Rick and the Celtics lead 111 to 89 by 22 points. Shaney from outside on the miss. Bird another rebound. That's 15. Buckner. Celtics took control in the second quarter and have never given it up. Henderson trying to get it into Maxwell, and it, Maxwell keeps it alive back out to Bird. Mitchell Anderson, rookie, is in for the Sixers. Bird trying to get it to Maxwell in low, out of bounds off Philadelphia, uh, the Sixers. It'll be Boston ball. Max, jump hook, gets two more. Max has had a big game, 17 points. He's got 12 rebounds. The Celtics, by the way, that was a fancy Good move job. there by Frank Edwards. Edwards. The Celtics have out-rebounded Philadelphia by a tremendous margin in this game. Philly is thanking themselves considerably on the boards, as we pointed out. So I'm not sure that it still puts them on a par with the Celtics. I think that front line. Bird, nice move. Bird now with 31. 31 points, 15 rebounds for Larry Bird. Celtics 115 to 91, their biggest lead of the game, 26 points, as they have, quite frankly, blown Philadelphia's doors off here tonight. They took over in the second quarter, outscored Philly by 12 points, had a 15-point lead at the half, never really looked back. 49 to 34, the Celtic rebounding edge in this game. Bird matches his uniform number. 33. Woo. Buckner setting it up nicely off the McHale rebound and feed. And not only that, but they've maintained their intensity for the full 48. They really haven't had a defensive letdown uh, all game long, and this is, it's made it difficult. Philly's had their six-point runs and all, but they haven't had really a sustained offensive explosion all game long. Celtics have taken a timeout with 152 to go as Mitchell Anderson cuts it to 117 to 94. It's academic now. Minute and 52 to go. The Celtics are rolling with a 23-point lead. And Bob Cousy at the Garden. Darren Tillis and Charles Bradley have checked in for the Celtics as they are blasting Philadelphia. Rebound to Charles. Tries to strong arm it up. Couldn't. McHale gets it. Al Kuz, the story of this game was the second quarter where the Celtics just took complete control and uh, off of the heavy defensive pressure that allowed Philadelphia only two baskets in the final eight minutes of the second quarter. And uh, from then on, it was, you know, just a Celtics game. Philly chopped it down to like 14 in the third quarter, but the Celtics quickly regained uh, the big 18, 19 point lead. Uh, you know, it's everyone has said it that's been involved with this game so often that's where you win basketball games with the defense the key move you know is taking some of the offense away from Malone with that double team uh, in the second half they continued it and he continued to fight it so he became somewhat ineffective but he wasn't giving points away to teammates who were free and uh, I thought that made a big difference in the uh, final outcome one thing about this game Bob is that every Celtic that has played tonight and they've all played now but every Celtic that played when the game was you know on the line in the first two three quarters 41 seconds left Celtics 121 97 leading every guy that has played has contributed a Absolutely. great deal from birds 33 points to ML cars two consecutive steals in a five second span in the uh, second quarter well when you're talking about defensive consistency that's something every one of the guys can do you know it's not it's just a question of working hard at it and you're going to produce results Bradley gets to work pretty hard at it and produces a, a two-point result it is uh, 23 97 you know, the offense can be sporadic or you can be trying hard but it doesn't necessarily make the ball go in but defensively if you work as hard as all of the sellers work tonight right it's generally not always but generally going to produce this kind of a result and it's a standing O for the Celtics as they blow the Sixers away. 123 to 97. And Boston has moved into a first place tie in the Atlantic Division of the Eastern Conference. The Celtics are now 17 and 4. Philadelphia is now 17 and 4. Final score at the Boston Garden. The Celtics 123. Philadelphia 97. <laughs>